before your first flight. Start by charging the flight battery with the charger provided. The charger holds up to three flight batteries that are charged one after the other. When the green LED is flashing, a charging process is underway. When the battery is full, the charger will sound an acoustic signal and the LED will show a continuous green light. Also charge the controller by connecting it to a suitable USB port with the cable provided. You can check the state of the built-in battery using the LED lights in the middle of the remote control. As a rule, you should never store the Mantis Q batteries empty, as this can damage them. While the batteries are charging, it's time to download the Unique Pilot app. Search in the App Store or simply scan the relevant QR code in the Mantis battery compartment. Once everything is charged, you can get started. Please insert the flight battery first. Connect your smartphone to the controller. Switch on first the controller and then the Mantis by pressing the power button until you hear a rising tone sequence. Start the Unique Pilot app and select the scan icon on the home screen. Then scan the QR code located on the side of the Mantis. The controller and Mantis Q are now connected. We recommend checking for available updates first of all. Tap on the settings icon and then on the three dots. Scroll down until you find the software updates menu option and tap on it. Then follow the instructions on the screen. Congratulations, you're ready for your first flight.